Hey, what's up? This is Oscar De La Hoya, and you are watching BoxersAndBrawlers.com. Welcome to another edition of Fight Breakdown here in Studio 1601 with Boxers and Brawlers. I'm Alvin. I'm John David. And in the house today, we got none other than Joseph the Texas Mongoose Rodriguez from here in San Antonio. Joseph, thanks for joining us yes, here sir. today. No problem. What's up, man? Yep. Joseph, now, you're 7-0, and uh, and you've got a fight coming up here on December the 8th here at Cowboys Dance Hall. Yes, uh, do we know who the opponent's going to be at? Uh, I mean, they've been shooting a lot of names out there, but we're not sure on the opponent yet. But um, today is Sunday, so around like Tuesday, Wednesday, we should find out who. Do you have a preference? Uh, do, what, what do you like to fight? Do you like to fight southpaws? Do you like orthodox? What, do, what is your preference in these types of fights? Mm, southpaws are, are slick, so I, I like to, I like um, competition. So mm. I would rather fight a left-hander. My dad's left-handed, so every time we do the mitts or whatever, he stays left-handed. So, I mean, it's something that you do all the time. Yeah, some, so I, I would rather fight a left-hander. And a lot of guys say, ah, I don't know. I'd rather not be that. Yeah. I, love, I love competition. Now, now speaking <coughs> of your father, uh, he, he's your trainer. He's been training you for uh, uh, all your boxing career, basically, yeah, right? Career. And he's from the old school uh, of boxing. Now, he came up in uh, <laughs> Sasamora, is that right? Yeah, yeah. yeah and uh, with, the, with the Ayalas. Mm -hmm. uh, and I know that he loves that, that sparring, hard sparring and all that. Yeah. Is that what y'all been doing lately in the gym? Yeah, lately, yeah. We've been working hard to, to you know, basically finish my opponent, not to just... You know, look for it, look for it to basically just finish them, put them in a stretcher if we can, you know, that's, yeah. that's basically what it is now, yeah. now these days. So uh, a lot of the fans, they want to see, you know, Chincaso, they want to see yeah, knockouts. They want to see Chincaso. Are you working for more power now? Yeah, I've been working for more power. Like, I went to a training camp a couple of weeks back in uh, Detroit, so that was the, the main purpose, um, okay. to, to work on our power. So it's been working lately. Now, I noticed uh, as well that uh, a couple of the opponents that you took out was to body punches, right? I oh, mean, yeah, yeah. So that's that's one of your, your, your main emphasis as well, yeah, is going body. to the body, correct? Body, yeah. yeah. So uh, you've only fought here in, 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 in Texas. Uh, when can we expect the Texas Mongoose to go on the road? 7-0 um, right now, so we're looking after ten about 10 more fights. Um, we start like California Bay or all over, different places. But mainly Golden Boy um, is California. Which you are a Golden Boy yeah, fighter Golden right Boy now. Fighter, so um, after about 10 fights, they already told me we'll start fighting you more California based, different places out there, get your, get your name out there. So after 10 fights, you know, people are going to start seeing me different places. And, um, and we're looking for the MGM gram, you know, one day. That's, that's good, that's, that's good, that's good. Now, who, who out there, as far, as far as fighters that have made it, per se, world champions, would you like to pattern your... Uh, style after who do, who is that there that you'd like to see as far as your favorite fighter like who would you like to kind of yeah um, mimic I, your fighting I like Marco Antonio Baer and, and not many people know that but I like his just his attitude towards boxing and he, I mean he's he's a slick uh, Mexican but he when he turns it up he puts on you see and, his and face. he's actually a very smart fighter, smart he, fighter. Can, he, was, he can outbox you as he well can outbox you. and I, I don't know if y'all know but he was a um, um, what do you call it a uh, a lawyer. He was a lawyer wow. back in Mexico. Wow, he's so a he's a real educated man. So yeah. when he fights in there, you can see the, you know, he's smart. But when he gets he's, mad, he's a he, thinking he, yeah, fighter. He's a thinking, yeah. But you see that face. That, that's why he's baby face assassin. Yeah. So I, I would like something like that because a lot of people say I'm a pretty boy. And and, and I think he, he started at it 126. I think. Yeah. Right? Well, he started 122. 122. He fought Junior Jones. Yeah, he fought yeah. all those guys. Yeah. And he's a boxer brother. Boxer yeah. brother. Yeah. That's why he's a boxer. He's a perfect, he's a perfect uh, baby face assassin. It's perfect. Yeah. Because yeah. he look like you know he has that little like a nice guy and then when he gets in there yeah you see his face expression. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He 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 wanted to get you out yeah. again in the studio. Joseph the Texas Mongoose. Now on December the eighth we got a big fight here in town at, at the Cowboys Dance Hall where we're going to have several uh, San Antonio-based fighters all undefeated. We got Javier Pitbull, Rodriguez. We got Jairo Castaneda. Crescenza Ramos is also on that card. But the headline was John David. Turning back to you. Tell me something about Ivan Morales that we don't know. It's going to be Ivan Morales. I mean, we, we pretty much know everything about him. We just don't. What we don't know, I guess we can say we don't know about him, is uh, if what he's going to look like against different competition. Um, he's still on the low end where the competition stands, and we're looking for him to move up. Uh, and and up. at the guy, at, at that, he's got 26 fights or, or something like that, and and uh, uh, he's basically still fighting unknowns. Definitely, uh, yeah, we still don't know who he's fighting now. Uh, yeah, we, yeah we don't, I don't even know who he's fighting. Yeah. I'm, I'm with the promotion. I ask them, they, they don't know yet. So it's going to be a guy that, 
you know, it, I hate to say it, but... You know, we're trying to bring him trying up. Bring we're him trying up. to bring him up. And just uh, recently added to that card, we got Joseph Jojo Diaz on that card as well. Now, here's another action fighter. Uh, this this guy's undefeated, Olympian. Uh, he, uh, he's going to be fighting again. We don't know who he's fighting, but I'm sure it's going to be an all-action fight. Sa sa uh, it's, on it's on a Monday. Monday, December the 8th. Uh, so make sure you all tune in to, to see those fights. And uh, again, this is Alvino Valles. And this is... I'm John David. And in the studio with Joseph Texas Mongoose Rodriguez. Thank you so long.